Stay tuned and watch me unbox this soldering station and demonstrate how it works. So I've never done one of these videos before and uh, it's an unboxing video. And here you can see um, a box that I got and it is an SMD rework solder station. And it's pretty cool, and I thought uh, maybe people might enjoy watching me unbox this. My son Ryan got this for me for Christmas. He's a good kid. And there you go. There's the instruction manual. Um, cool. Yeah, I never read the instructions. But here you can see uh, there's a hot air gun. And and a soldering iron and here's some tips and I don't know what the hell this is yeah whatever and uh, some tips whoops some tips for the uh, hot air and I think the ideal is that uh, the hot air is hot enough to melt solder and uh, I think you uh, you melt the solder and then you just pull the stuff apart. Anyway, we'll give it a try here in a little bit. Whoa! Oh, this is cool. Sweet. Oh, super sweet. Look at that. That is neat. Yeah, it also comes with a thing to hold the soldering iron. And, oh, look, you can put all the tips in there. That's kind of sweet. And, whoa, this must hold the uh, hot air gun. Is that it? That's it. So a little closer inspection. The hot air gun here is permanently attached to the front. Um, there seems to be auto and manual mode. Um, I guess these are temperature outputs. Soldering, hot air, Soldering temperature, hot air temperature. Huh. Pretty neat. The uh, soldering gun plugs in there, and there are five leads. That's interesting. Oh, look, a little plastic tip over the end of the... Huh, that's weird. I love these little, uh, I save these stupid things. I'll use them later for something else. But uh, I got a box I put them in. I, I guess I don't throw nothing away. I've been accused of that. My wife says I'm this far from being a hoarder. I got news for her. I'm already a hoarder. Okay. See, I hope I'm doing this right. Guess if nothing works, I'll look at the directions. Uh, where does this go? There's like all kinds of screws. Oh, I bet it goes there. Does this thing screw on somewhere? I think this just sets. Yeah, this just sets here. And put all these little tips in there. That's cool, huh? There we go. Not so much of the grinder. I like how it comes in the neat little Ziploc bag here. <laughs> Heavy duty sucker.
Yeah, they thought you think they could have attached that for you. I wonder which way it goes. It has to go that way. All right, I'll get this attached. Okay, so got her plugged in, got her all assembled. There she is. It's really cool how this works. You turn on the power. This is the power to the soldering iron. This is the power to the hot air. Takes them a little while to uh, to warm up. I can adjust the temperature. Okay, let's adjust it to 200. Okay, I'm fat fingering it. There it is, 200. It'll drop down to it gets the 200 from the temperature it was at. Make that 256. Now, it won't do anything until I pull it out of there. And then there it goes. Isn't that cool? Heat. Hot. Ooh, hot, hot. I can change the temperature. I can change the airspeed. Whatever I want, whatever I need. Probably have to do a little experimenting. But hey, that's cool. All right, now I need to find something to take apart. All right, so like I said, I never throw nothing away. And here's my uh, jug of scrap uh, circuit boards. Pull one out of here. Pull something out. I have no idea what this circuit board is. There's an old circuit board. And we're going to give her a try. Who knows what will happen. I really want to try this hot air gun. So that's probably what we're going to do first. See if I can desolder these wires. Ooh, that's hot. Yeah, I think I'm burning it. I'm getting smoke. Woo! Hot, hot, hot. There we go. Boy, that works slick. Pulled those right off. Look at that. Now I need to shut her down. Let it cool down. That worked pretty slick. Pulled those. Where is it? There it is. Pulled those off. You can see it left. Left the holes clean. Where are you at? There you are. Left the holes clean. Sweet. I like that. Bonus. This fell off too. <laughs> A lot of stuff got hot on the back side and came off. That's okay. Like I said it's a scrap circuit board. Okay, so to wrap it up. <clears throat> the SD rework station is an 862D plus. 
from Zinni says, I got it off of eBay. I think I paid 60 bucks for it. It's a total buy. Get it if you can get it. If you're going to do a lot of circuit board work, this is the monster for you.